Now, with the only tri-state forecast that's independently certified most accurate, here's meteorologist Jennifer Schaff. A great Sunday shaping up. If you have any outdoor plans today, sunshine expected and dry conditions. On the WLWT radar, we have dry weather across the entire tri state. There have been just a couple of showers from the bluegrass south into southern Kentucky, but they're drifting south and east and away from the region, and we will stay dry today. This is radar estimated rainfall over the last 48 hours. Wanted to bring it up to highlight the rainfall from Friday night to our northwest and the rainfall from yesterday to our southeast, but the in between across the tri state. We stayed pretty quiet yesterday morning, a couple of downpours and a few sprinkles yesterday afternoon, but not much in the way of measurable rainfall. So our rainfall almanac from yesterday, nothing official at the International Airport. For the month, we are ahead already one week in, and we've seen over an inch of rain. For the year, we are approaching 30. 32 inches of rain. We are ahead for the year by right around an inch and a half. So a dry couple of days, and then we'll bring back our rain chance as we head into our midweek. 63 right now. We dropped off this morning into the upper 50s. That dew point right now in the upper 50s is very comfortable. It'll stay there through the afternoon. A northeast wind currently at 7 miles an hour. Temperatures into the upper 60s by 11 a.m., upper 70s this afternoon. Sunshine throughout the stretch today. I think we'll start to reintroduce a couple. Couple of clouds as we head into tomorrow. 63 the current temperature in Cincinnati, but there are spots still in the 50s at this point, and comfortable conditions through our afternoon today will top out in the mid to upper 70s. Sunshine will stick around, and by tomorrow, we start to bring back just a couple of clouds. Some moisture to our southeast will kind of start to work its way back in. Here's a satellite and radar with a band of showers and clouds just behind a cold front to our southeast. They're exiting. We have high pressure building in from the Great Lakes, and around high pressure is the clockwise wind. So a little bit of a northeast wind today drawing in some dry air. High pressure still around for tomorrow. Highs today and tomorrow just a few degrees below average. But notice the moisture that's kind of lingering along the Carolina coast. We're going to see some of it get sent back into our direction for tomorrow. So a few more cumulus clouds on Monday. We'll call it mostly sunny. And by Tuesday, we're talking partly cloudy. A little bit more activity close by, but probably not overhead quite yet. Still calling for a dry day on Tuesday. But take a look off to our northwest with a cold front behind the banner. That next front brings back the chance for widespread rain into our midweek and then much cooler temperatures as we sail into next weekend. 78 degrees for a high today. The sunshine, a northeast wind at 5 to 10 miles an hour. The winds stay light tonight. Skies stay mostly clear. An even cooler start tomorrow morning. We dip down to 53, which means some rural spots. Around 50, if not some upper 40s, dropping off tonight. 80 degrees for a high tomorrow. A lot to enjoy for Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday. Partly cloudy skies at 83 on Tuesday. Wednesday, more storms start to build in. We'll have to watch the timing for that cold front. It does look like it has a lot of moisture with it and probably some stronger storms, but kind of fine tune when it comes in. Right now, it looks like the overnight Wednesday into Thursday. Behind that, some cool to uh, maybe even chilly air next weekend. Saturday, a high of only 66. Oh, yeah, Jonathan. 66 degrees on a Saturday.